Good morning from the Philippines and Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, all of that jazz because we're actually in the Philippines over the two week Christmas break. I hope you had a great one because by the time this vlog goes up it will have long gone. We're in the Philippines for a couple of weeks exploring. We're going to be going to four different destinations so thank you for joining me on my latest adventure. We will be exploring Shargo Island which is where we are right now. We'll also be going to Cebu, which is where we flew into, so that's where we got our international flight from. And we'll be going to El Nido and Coron. Now we are backpacking on this trip, which is something a little bit new for us. For those of you that have watched any of my travel vlogs before, you'll know that I specialise in luxury travel, as does my blog, clutchandcarryon.com, which I'll always link in the description box below because I'll write about every single trip. But this trip is a bit different because we're backpacking, but we're not necessarily backpacking to save money and stay in hostels. We're backpacking because it's the kind of country that is just so much easier to explore if you are free of the wheels so we've got a backpack on our back a backpack on our front the hubby and I am here with Mems and we are exploring so we're going to be staying in some really lovely luxury places this is one of them actually this is called Isla Cabana here in Chicago Island it's beautiful let me just show you the view from my room right now I'm just in my mosquito net I've got a little private pool and it goes out to that gorgeous beach and we're also going to be staying in a couple of hostels and we're going to be doing a boat trip for five days from El Nido to Caron. So it's going to be a bit of a mix between luxury and backpack. And I hope that you'll enjoy that because I think if you are coming to somewhere like the Philippines, the luxury hotels are really affordable. I think this one was like £100 a night and anywhere else in the world, this resort would be hundreds of pounds a night. So I think it's quite a good way to show you all the Philippines. If you are planning a trip here, watch on. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel as of yet, I'm make travel videos every time I travel. Last year I went to 24 different countries and I'm sure next year has, well this year now we'll have a lot in store so please do subscribe to my channel. Here we go, let's explore the Philippines. A collision of decisions whirling in my heart and my vision a recession has never been this hard i got wasted when i tasted the sweetness of your lips we're not ready we're unsteady i'm stuck inside your grip i'm going down 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 like a waterfall you're keeping us miles apart you got me down 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 like a waterfall you know Has never been this close And the matter if I'd rather Just lock myself indoors I'm righteous So we're in El Nido right now. We spent three days in total on Chago Island and it was absolutely incredible. I couldn't recommend it enough if you're coming to the Philippines. We got an internal flight from Cebu International Airport and it was about half an hour or something really short like that and quite affordable as well. We flew with Cebu's 
Pacific Airlines and we stayed in a place called Isla Cabana which I highly recommend it was gorgeous it was a four star and it was actually quite affordable we had this beautiful room with the pool and the view was insane it was so so pretty the sea was gorgeous it had two infinity pools and it was just a little slice of paradise if I'm honest and we actually explored the island of Shargo a little bit there's palm trees absolutely everywhere little wooden shacks stray dogs galore oh my goodness there were so many stray dogs and they were so cute they'd come up for a cuddle and a stroke um it's really famous for surfing that particular island so we did go a little bit further north we just took out some bikes from the hotel um, and went to a place called cloud nine which if you're a surfer you'll want to go to and also there's quite a cool like buzzy atmosphere there as well so the locals and travelers just go there to watch the surfers so that was quite cool but we mainly spent time in our resort because it was just paradise. So then we flew from Chargo to Cebu International, which is where we flew out from, and then we went straight on another flight to here, which is El Nido. This is probably one of the most famous tourist spots here in the Philippines, and we're actually just stopping by. We're going on a boat trip from El Nido all the way through to Caron, but we've got one spare day in El Nido, so we're going to go and discover it a little bit today. We're going to hire a moped, I think. Um, and speaking of mopeds, if you come to the Philippines, rather than getting cars, you have to get the scooters. They're hilarious. They're one man scooters, but they have this huge big tin can kind of car seat. It's kind of a scooter that's made into a car. We went on about a half an hour journey from the airport to our hotel, well, bed and breakfast, and it cost us 250 pesos, which is like five pounds for both of us and our bags. So as we're only here for one night, we are staying in budget accommodation. We're at the Amacan, um, which is really nice and clean, but it's definitely budget. I mean, it's just a plain bed aircon, we've got a shower, a toilet, a sink, um, and that's it really. We've got breakfast included, but we're only here for one night. So as I said, we're mixing it up with the budget and the luxury. Right, so today we are off on a five day boat trip. We've got our backpacks on. I don't know if I've actually shown you <laughs> us dressed in our backpack gear as of yet, um, but we're not gonna have any electricity or signal. So this is a video on my phone, hence the quality dip. Um, but I'm just trying to maximize all of the camera gear that I have with me because obviously I'm not going to be able to charge anything. So we're going to be going from El Nido, which is where we are right now, through to Caron, stopping along the way at lots of fabulous little islands. I'm very, very excited. And we're going to be camping on the beach in the evening as well. Hope you can hear me. It's quite noisy. camping on this beach tonight. It's so gorgeous and we've got pretty much the whole entire beach to ourselves. It's actually a bit further up from Napcan Beach which is one of the most famous beaches in El Nido and we just, this is our boat right here, so we went to a few different snorkeling spots today and then we've just rocked up to this beach and we're going to set up our tents. We've got our rum and coke, we've got our beer, we've got food which is being cooked for us barbecue style. This is going to be the most epic five days.
And this is our home for tonight. Pretty neat. And if you can see the hats there on the beach. So we just arrived at our second campsite and we've had a shower for the first time in 48 hours and I feel fantastic. So we're just going to watch the sunset once again. This time we're actually staying in these cute little huts rather than camping on the beach which is quite a nice upgrade and we have a real toilet and we had fresh water. I say I've just had a shower, I just poured buckets of water over my head so not quite a shower but it was still awesome. This is the reason you put up with the bucket showers. You just don't get this otherwise. another day in the Philippines. So last night we camped um, in little wooden huts actually on the beach. It was beautiful waking up on the beach once again to sunrise. We're now exploring another one of the little islands. This one has a secret beach apparently. It's so pretty. Just check out the sand and the sea colour. It's just insane. We got a summer up, a kind of movie love. All in for some more of anything that comes along.
obsession has never been this close And the matter if I rather just lock myself indoors I'm righteous and this virus no dog or pill can cure This pattern won't turn it you got me by the core I'm going down 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 like a waterfall You keeping us miles apart You got me driver is stopping every time he sees a stray dog and we're feeding the little doggies.